Hi there everyone, this is Mailman Zero playing Earthbound. We have just completed releasing the Runaway 5 from their contract. We've got a nice tour bus here all ready to go. We're gonna talk to our friend here, Captain Awesome Glasses. Let's go to Threed! Our bus is too loud for any ghosts to bother us, so I didn't really show you, but basically, if you tried to go to Threed, you have to take the bus. And the bus won't go because the ghosts, so this tour bus will take us there. We sure do! Get on the bus! Here we go! Hey, that's the wrong way! Yeah, sidewalk. Get out of our way. And that dog, too. Goodbye, Berglund Park. Goodbye, stop sign we ran. Take an orange kid and an apple kid and a Tucson town. See you later, everybody. We're going to three. Never to come back. Unless we feel like it. Oh, I could have had that present of some kind. The Runaway Five! Oh, hello, ghost. Are you gonna follow us? Oh, and it runs away because it's too loud. And two more ghosts are gone. Yeah, we got Pac-Man on this bus. Wow, it took us a long time to get there. It turned into nighttime. Yeah, say goodbye. Yeah, what's up with it being so, uh, dark? Why is my dog barking? Hope to see you again sometime. Look for us to be singing at some theater in Foreside. So why'd they just skip three? I mean, why even take us here? Why not just take us to Foreside? Right? I mean, is there a reason for us to be here? Hello, masked kid. I, I keep wanting to talk to people too far away. Zombies and ghosts are on the loose here. Welcome to three. Welcome indeed. I don't understand. My dog waits until I start recording to bark. What? What is this? Get that out of here. Alright. Hello. The headquarters of the Zombie Relief Corps is in the circus tents at the center of town. We want to crush the zombies, except I think they'll crush us. The zombies? This does not sound safe at all. I, yeah, let's go to the drugstore. Let's see what's, what we've got at the drugstore. What do we have available? Let's just take out a bunch of money so that we can buy whatever we want. What? Oh. I always want to hit the B button. 6,000, huh? Well, let's just... Oops, let's just take out 6,000. See how that works. Talk to this guy. A minor league bat and a thick fry pan. I already have a hard hat. You know, all about hard hats. Alright. Of course I will. Oh, of course not. No. No. Okay. What can we do here? Goods? I guess we could give the croissant to Paula. Okay, let's try this again. We will buy a minor league bat. Ness will carry it, and I will equip it. Yes. Yes. I will buy a thick fry pan. Paula will carry the fry pan, and she will equip it. Of course. You're welcome. No. So let's put some money back in. We will deposit, let's say, I don't know, about 4,000. You know what? 
why don't we go ahead and just deposit another thousand? Okay, that's not bad. Let's go ahead and do a save. Well, you know what? I'm going to call this Cargo Express, too. Yeah, yeah. Um, I want you to pick up some of my stuff. And while we're waiting, we can call Dad. Alright, record my game. Hit the hey, why don't you? And we will continue. Alright. Let's see if Escargo Express is coming around. It usually takes them a while, so I don't think that's going to happen too fast. Whoa! I guess <laughs> Mr. Escargo Express found us behind the building. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, we will give him... What do we not need anymore? Oh, you know, it's stuff that Paula has. She has backstage pass. We'll give him that. Mm, no. So as far as I know, you don't ever need the backstage pass for the rest of the game. So let's talk to Mr. Mercenary over here. Whoa, what's he got? Well, these are interesting items. Obviously, there are some things that we can't use here. Nope. Yeah, I'll, I will do that. I can't get through these buildings. Okay, well, let's... have ourselves a little jaunt. Where's the best place to go if you're uh, looking for zombies? I'd have to say a graveyard's a good place to go. Oh, look at that. I'm fighting a trash can. Oh my goodness, that is a putrid moldy man, and a smelly ghost. I guess we'll... Oh, that does almost nothing. Life up. Oh, those are some heavy attacks you've got there. Um, maybe I can use some psychic power on these guys. Not really sure here. Yeah, I guess we've got all sorts of stuff we could use on them. Let's let's try a freeze attack. Freeze is always good for a try. Oh good. The spores make me cry. That's just what I need. I guess we'll do the same thing again. Try uh I don't know. Let's try another freeze attack. Seems like uh, Paula's attack only did one, so... Okay, so the smelly ghost is done. Let's see if she can do anything to the putrid moldy man. Ah, oh, some good experience. All right. Oh, there's another trash can. These trash can decoys are kind of scary. Not exactly what I was expecting. Come on, there's got to be something in here. What are these guys? Flies and a trash can. No good fly. Well, okay, we got some bigger stuff. What's. Oh, it's still to one enemy, though. Two enemy. Well, let's see what happens. <laughs> I guess you can't really pick, it just goes on whatever it wants. Yeah, let's let's focus our attacks over here. Now, she only did one, one hit point. How is that possible that Paula can only do one hit point on that guy? Oh, good thing I haven't attacked him yet. Let's do a bigger attack for Paula. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's a good one for Paula. OK. 
Okay. Oh good, more ghosts. Zombie Possessor. This doesn't sound good at all. Um, I don't know. Let's do some major stuff on these guys and see what we can come up with. Oh good. I got possessed by a mini ghost and I used something that makes no sense and Paula is dead. Nothing happened. Got him out of the way. Putrid Moldy Man did something crazy. Tiny little ghost. Yeah, he can't do it again. You already got me. Man, I am not doing well. I guess we'll do some life up. I can't get possessed again. And now I'm crying. I guess... Get this guy again? I don't know. Oh good. Oh good. I am going to do another one of these. These zombie possessor guys are freaky. Yeah, goodbye to you. Goodbye to you. And not goodbye to you. That tiny little ghost that's on me is freaking me out. Man, these guys can just get right out of my way when I try to attack them. Well, Ness got some major experience points there. Now what am I supposed to do with this? I got a stinking ghost hanging around me now? It's gonna hang around for whenever I do battle, I guess. Wait, does, can I do... Oh, look at that. I can see everything. So, I need to go to the hospital so I can get Paula back. I, I, I don't have time to talk to you, kid. I gotta get to the hospital. Where am I? Oh, it's down there. Whoa, no! I didn't know those were enemies! Handsome Tom, these guys are... Oh, Smiling Sam and Handsome Tom, these guys are probably really scary, so I am going to use some really strong attack. This icy hand thing is scaring me. I think that that icy hand thing will eventually kill me. Oh, no, it doesn't kill me, it just turns me so I don't move. Awesome. Man, Ness is gonna, gonna get another level before uh, Paula gets anything. There are some creepy things in this town. This guy do anything? Purify, no. Okay, so I guess I can't get rid of those. Let's get Paula back. Yes. Oh man, okay. What is this guy here for? Stronger than a zombie, but a bunch of zombies gang up on me. Oh yeah. I don't know what I'm supposed to do about this. This uh, tiny little guy. Oh, I don't want to fight those guys. I think... I think I, maybe I should go to the hotel. Come on, hotels. Maybe if I go to the hotel and sleep it off, maybe this ghost will go away. Hello, man with no nose. A hundred and twenty do- Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, I feel so much better. I had a possessed night's sleep. What does this guy gotta say? The Zombie Herald. Destroy the humans! Hold the town for our glory and for the glory of our master! Yeah, not a good idea. Uh, 
I've got to figure out how to get rid of this ghost. 